But first, a pizzeria in the Bronx busted for selling more than just pizzas. Investigators say they found millions of dollars worth of illegal drugs. And good evening to you at 6 o'clock. I'm Liz Chow. And I'm Bill Ritter. Prosecutors say they have taken down a sophisticated drug trafficking operation across from a school. Yeah, police say it was so large it had the potential of supplying drug networks throughout the entire Northeast. I would as usual report Kimberly Richardson is in the Soundview section with our lead story tonight. Kim. Well, Liz, next to the garlic knots here inside this pizzeria, authorities say samples of crack cocaine for customers. Not far away, fentanyl, just two milligrams of that drug is considered lethal. Tonight, parents and those who have been coming here for years are wondering how they missed all the red flags. Get out of here. I never, 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 and I was born and raised here. Here in the Soundview section of the Bronx, where authorities say this man, Guandancio Perez, was the mastermind behind a sophisticated drug operation inside this pizzeria. Had you ever been in there for food? Yeah, I got me a couple of slices out of there. The small, now shuttered business is at 553 Soundview Avenue, where in the basement, police say they found loads of suspected cocaine, 42 kilos heroin, fentanyl, oxycodone, and 100 vials of crack cocaine. Workers allegedly stored that near the counter for easy sales and samples for customers. All of this right next to a community center and across the street from an elementary school, PS69. Sade's two kids go there. It's heartbreaking, right under your nose. Wow. Did the you kids go to school. I mean, the kids go, they get pizza, they get candy, they get their snacks for school. Perez allegedly ran the operation inside Megzarella Pizza with his wife, Zulima, and this man from Connecticut, Alexander Samboy. Police maintained Thursday morning they spotted the couple transferring a large bag from a car and into the pizzeria. Samboy shows up and leaves in a car with a backpack. When authorities pulled him over, they allegedly found five kilos of suspected cocaine. They're marked R2. I thought they were nice people. They were good because I've known them for years. Also in the basement, authorities say a kilo press and $40,000 in cash. This is New York, baby. Anything possible, but it's sad by the school, but anything is possible right across the street from the school. Perez is now being held without bail. Bail was set at $150,000 for the other two defendants. For now